Hey friends, it's Eric and today we're going to be looking at the Eufy Solar Cam S340, which you're going to absolutely love this camera. This is one of my favorite cameras to date. It is totally wireless or wire free, except for it does have a solar panel and there's a wire in between the camera and the solar panel, but I'll get into that in just a moment. Today, I'm going to tell you three things that you're going to want to know about this camera before you decide to buy it or not. Let's jump into the video. Now, the first thing that you need to know is, like I said, this is a wire-free camera, meaning that there's no power wire, there's no data wire. All you need is sunlight and Wi-Fi, and you're good to go. Now, there is a wire between the solar panel and the camera itself. However, as long as you mount this in the location where the camera is and the solar panel can get good sunlight, you can just wrap it around and you won't even see that wire. However, if you don't have good sunlight and you're within 10 feet of the solar panel, there is a wire in between. This is a great, great design as quite surprised how small this solar panel is. Their previous model solar panels were probably about double the size, but they still say as long as you get about two hours of sunlight per day, you have no problem with a power forever design. And I really like inside the app, you can kind of see what's going on on with the battery and the solar power generation and really see how it's performing and if you need to move that solar panel or not. So it's really great to see that. And I've been using it for a couple months now and I haven't had any issues with power. Even when I'm using it more, it still stays above 90%. Now you do want to keep in mind that this is a Wi-Fi camera and you want to make sure that you have great Wi-Fi signal where you want to place this so you can't go too far from your house but I have put a couple Eufy cameras in trees outdoors but your particular Wi-Fi setup is going to be different than mine so just be aware of that. But being able to put this camera anywhere on the outside of your house under eave or maybe even in the tree and then having the solar panel 10 feet away in direct sunlight is a huge great benefit and overall a great design and definitely is one of my favorite cameras to date. This camera also has two lenses, which is the second thing that you need to know. So you get the wide angle lens which is a 3K resolution. And then at the exact same time, it's recording a second camera lens, which is a telephoto, which is a 2K lens. So you're recording both at the exact same time so you can see what's going on in the general area with the wide angle. And then you can see people's faces and license plates with the telephoto. So you can kind of see the overall picture, but still be able to see what you need to see if something happens. This is built onto a 360 degree pan and tilt mechanism. So it will lock onto a movement or a subject and track them as long as they're continuing to move, which is great. The camera also has color night vision, which ideally I really don't like. That just means the light will turn on and then it can record, it can see what's going on. I really like the infrared night vision, which it also has. So it's going to shine infrared red light and you can kind of see a little bit better a little bit farther although it's in more of a black and white color which i particularly like but you can pick your favorite night vision in the settings now the third thing that you need to know is that this records to a internal memory of about eight gigs which is really not a lot now the things to remember is that it's going to record only clip recordings when it sees motion you can have some settings of how long it's going to record for and at resol what resolution so you can kind of control that um, depending on how active the camera is um, you're probably going to get seven to ten days recording all locally to the camera now you might be saying that's not enough storage for me, which I totally understand. They do have a home base three, which you can put onto your network inside your house and add up to 16 terabytes to the home base three. And you can add up to 16 cameras to the home base three. So you can really have great security all around your house. And this is just one of many cameras that works with the home base three. So you're storing all your video clips on inside your house rather than on the actual camera itself. 
Overall, this is a great design and great camera. I've been having a lot of fun with this. It's definitely monitoring my house 24 hours a day and I see what's going on. I can remotely log into the app when I'm at work, see what's happening. And if anything ever does go down, I know it's going to be recorded on my home base three and overall i absolutely love this camera it's definitely one of my favorite eufy cameras to date hope this video was helpful if you guys have any questions about it let me know down in the comments below i will see you guys on the next video thanks for watching